Huzzah, everybody. We're still powering through the jungle. Heading north to... Uh, what is that? Tola Opajate. And uh, yeah, we should get there soon. Once we're there, we'll be able to at least stay for the night. It's probably going to be midnight by the time we get there, like I was saying at the end of the last episode. Also, the fog just cleared. Did you see that? Uh, I knew the wagon was going to start getting creaky. How close am I? I still have a ways. Let's, uh, let's get ahead of the wagon's creakiness, eh? We're going to need two wagon wheels. Have to buy more now, too. I think I only have two more after this. Four more after this. Yeah, four is a low amount of wagon wheels to have. You need to have more than four if you're going to be working in this world. And be doing anything meaningful. Still slightly used. Holy moly. Alright, we're running critically low on wagon wheels. I would like to revise my previous statement and uh, correct it to that. We are critically low on wagon wheels. How is it? New? What's this? New? Useless? Lovely? Plop them both in there. Useless basically means it's just going to break. Those... Oh, you know what? Those two that I used must have just been useless. Both of them. So we're... We're, we're low. We're not critically low, but we're low. Getting, getting a little chilly in here. I think I'm going to have to get my little fleece, or uh, not fleece on, but my uh, plaid shirt on. Regain a little bit of warmth. Oh, that was a beautiful, terrible correction. It was a terrible, terrible correction. Man, I almost died too. Did you see that? Alright, let's see what the wreckage of this cart looks like this time. Oh, hey! That ain't bad! Alright, let's go! <laughs> How many times have I taken that wagon off a cliff like that? <laughs> uh, I can only do that in this game. Uh, I don't do it in Red Dead, thank god. I suppose it would be very easy to get a wagon to uh, fucking fall off like that. The wagon physics in that game drive me insane. That's why I don't steal wagons for a living. And horses too. I don't like stealing horses and selling them. It's kind of a, a waste of time and money for me. I would rather go out and fish and hunt and come back with like a bazillion pelts. Look at that. Oh, it's 9 o'clock. We got here earlier than expected. Nice. Vintage armory. Lovely. What's this temple over here? What blasphemous temple is this? Stendar. Disgusting. I literally shook my head in disgust just now. You know, I think we're going to stay at the Lucky Griffin. That, that, it feels good to me to stay here. I'm a common citizen. Uh, rations keep me from starving to death. Ah, uh, my good sir. Ooh, you know I can't spice, uh, pass up that spicy grilled lizard. Uh, and also have a wheat beer, please. Oh, and um, may I also have a room. Saw that yawn that I just stifled as well. So I think we're just going to sleep here for uh, a solid ten ought to do. I wake up in a new room. You think I'm I'm drunk and I'm night I'm sleepwalking? You think that's what's happening? I honestly I would not be surprised if it was something like that. Uh, let's do the pastries this morning with uh, coffee. Am I doing another off-road puddle jump? Probably from here to. Shit. Here? What is that? 16 hours? So I'm here. I should probably puddle jump to 
there. That's four. That's ten. I should pr I should puddle jump to here. Bearcat Hall. Is Bearcat Hall? Let's go like this. There we go. This is the port. Bearcat Hall is here, and that would more or less put me in a northern trajectory to there, because this is what then twenty nine hours. So that's another 19 or so from here. So I should probably go to here. Maybe a 10 hour is too much. Maybe a 10 hour is too much. Maybe we get to to here in six. And we get to here. Then we get to here. And then we get to here. Because from here to here, that's only going to be like an eight or nine hour, nine hour trek. So here. I'm here to here to here. What's this? 18? 12? That's 12 hours? That's six hours? Oh, I'm down here, I see. Yeah, let's get to, let's get to here, let's get to here. That's, that's the play, that's the play. Am I concerned about food? Not really. Let's go north. We'll, we'll pop into this provisions and we'll buy what we can on the way out. That seems prudent enough. If I can find the entrance, that is. Hello, sir. What is that? A sword on there? Pretty cool. Sir, do you not have food? Boink. Take that wagon wheel, too. Thank you. Another provision place on the way out. Yep. Go the northwest. There he is. That is a wagon wheel on the ground. store and an equipment store lovely that should hold me over I may just go the whole 12 to be honest it's early in the morning we ate breakfast. We have... <laughs> it does dismount you. It's I think it's because I'm stepping up onto, like, this lip or this lip, and it's it's bonk bonk in my head, and I'm falling off. That's pretty funny, though. Alright. Let's save. Now, let us... So I'm bypassing... You, because you're the six, so I need to do the 12. All right. Wish me luck. I want to make good progress this day, this episode. I want to get to the Isle of Bel Belferia this episode. We've been farting around. The only reason why we're going to stop is if we see another one of them bandit settlements. And if we do, we're going to disperse the camp because Lord knows, just like in Civ... Fuck the barbarians. I don't even want to see them become a city-state. I want them just to be wiped off the map. This ain't this ain't some some camp like in Red Dead. You're gonna develop your little Clemens Point into a little little chamber of commerce, little little place of commerce. Hell no. Hell no. You ain't making a town there. You ain't making a city-state there. Barbarians. They need to be snuffed out. These these highwaymen, these roving bands of of brigadiers and highwaymen, they're done. They're done. You see them, you snuff them. You know what I mean? Snuff out their light. Reach into their heart with a wet forefinger and thumb and tss, look and extinguish that light. Then you huff incense of Mara. And you huff or sip hag's breath 
Actually, it's Hag's Breath, so you huff that. <laughs> you're like huffing bull because it's like they're inhalants, right? You're, you're huffing drugs. Just need to go sell all their shit for that added personality. You understand how personable Hag's Breath and Incense of Mara make you? That's three extra points of, of personality. If I didn't have those uh, chanted items that give me hunted hunted, I'd be using them. But this is a good time for me to stockpile on my drugs. And only carry those drugs. Because I don't care about Darl or Hitsap or Moon Sugar or Skooma. Maybe for the meme for the Skooma and Moon Sugar. Uh, but the, the other ones, Sleeping Tree Sap, Tobacco. You can get out of my life. I don't want to see that stuff. Although I think I should start using some of the other drugs for specific uses, but uh, <laughs> we'll see if that day ever comes. Hey, what's on the other side of this? Oh, that's Minecraft notes. Those are old Minecraft notes. Witch farm? Yeesh. That's forever ago. I already built a witch farm. But it's a game I haven't played in a while since we started playing Valheim again. Is uh, Minecraft. Basically, I had finished my major projects in there that I was working on at the time. We had built we built the gold farm. I built the witch farm. Uh, I expanded the villager. Uh, what is it? The villager rehabilitation process or something? Reintegration process. It, basically, I was doing the zombie thing where you transform them back and forth between a regular villager and a zombie. You cure them. You do that five times, and you get like, you get like a super. Um, sale on shit <clears throat> and uh i'd gotten it done i gotten that done basically i need to go back through and add more people to the main shopping area like for the town hall shopping center but i migrated the clergymen in underneath the uh the chapel and i migrated some armors and fletchers and stuff into the upper <clears throat> barracks and I've got every single enchant in the game done. We have librarians that basically serve all that function. So if you just need XP, you just go to our XP farm, gather XP, walk back, do your enchanting. You'll want to use one of those enchanting tools online that helps you get every single enchant on your armor. And then you can have, you know, the, uh, the platinum experience, as it were, for armor. <clears throat> Do I need to correct? I am correcting, just in case. Now when I return, I'm going to have to... I think I still need to do a couple. I think I have a couple loose ends to figure out for that. And then after that, it's working on the nether base. Iron farm's up and working. Gold farm's up and working, which is our two bottlenecks. Oh, and like I said, the witch farm is up and running as well. That gives us all of the resources that we require to get that done. <clears throat> And from there, it's oh wow, I fucking made it. That was record time. How about that? I'm almost, I'm almost to the shore. Look at this. Look at this. We're we're definitely staying the night here. Where do I want to go? Let's peep what these stores are right quick. What do we got? Equipment store and a gear score or <laughs> gear score. A gear store. Imagine if gear score was in that game. It'd be so in this game, that'd be so depressing. Maybe it's an ESO. And if it is, well, sorry for you, muckers. A wagon wheel? Don't mind if I do. Going to buy. Oh, I think I need to buy some more formal cloaks. That way, I can get my fur armor looking good. Shouldn't have to wear two cloaks with uh, the fur armor. Oh wow, that wagon wheel! What a find! What an absolute find! Wow, another one! Wow, another one!
Look at that. Wagon wheels. Beautiful. That is what I am talking about. Should, oh, nice. Should rest in, in what I've learned about mercantile. How close am I to leveling? 93%? Lordy. I should target a minor skill. The mouse in the dungeon. Uh, a savage griffin. Oh my god, cow, please. Cow, please, the lucky fawn. You know why I stayed at the Lucky Griffin? I just stayed at the Lucky Fun. Oh yeah, definitely a beggar. Okay, okay. This is a cool this is a cool in design. I think I, I think I've seen it before, but I mean the transparent windows mod really makes it feel new every single time. Uh, sir, I will have the bunny hash, I will have some delicious wine, and I will have a room for one day. Thank you. Scratching my leg. I'm chair bound for the last three episodes. I should probably get up soon and actually stretch my legs. Ah, here we go. Damn, this room is such tall ceilings. Uh, 7.30? We can read. What do we got? Still not broken. Battered. Do solid 10. Another good stretch. Oh, I did it! I leveled! 17! Four points! That's middling. Well, definitely bump you up to to be a natural 70. And then I think I want to do... Was it strength? Hold up. Attributes. Oh wait, where'd my window go? I had a window open for this. Also, is my pip working? My pip is not working, so let me do that too. There we go. Oh, I hit cancel. There we go. Oh, I hit cancel again. Wow. I'm uh, really good at this today. Let's scale this down. There you guys go. Uh, and then lock that preview. Alright. Attributes. Does strength do encumbrance? Yes. Strength times 1.5. So I think I want to start pumping strength again. Or should I do agility? What is agility again? Governs the ability to hit a target. Yeah, I need to get this to 80. So all my points now are going to be dedicated to here to get you to 80. And then... Uh, what is actual endurance? Governs hit points, healing rate, resistance to poisons and diseases, and fatigue... I think I'm going to start focusing on endurance after this. In fact, you know what? Let's do it. Let's get you to 60, eh? Because 60 will put me at very healthy. Because right now I'm just above average. I should be very healthy. Um, endurance modifies the time your character can hold his or her breath underwater. Maximizes the health points gained per level. <laughs> with the modifier increasing with 10 points of endurance. Endurance modifies the rate of healing per hour at rest with a modifier increasing with every 10 points of endurance. This refers to the rate of recovering health, not spell points. Spell points will always regenerate after 8 hours of resting, irrespective of any character attribute or skill. Okay. What's speed again? Oh, that's just... Oh, movement speed and weapon swing speed. My speed's 70. And then luck. Luck is just luck. And right now, I am just lucky. 
But I do eventually want to become fortunate. Yeah. Let's get endurance to 60. Then we'll get agility to 80. And then we'll start dumping into luck. I think that's I think that's the play. That is that is the play. You have ascended to level 17. Life isn't over. You can still get smarter or cleverer or more experienced or meaner. But your body and soul just aren't going to get any younger. <laughs> oh, I like that one. That one's cute. I wonder how far up those levels, uh, the levels go for uh, the level inspiration mod. Uh, I slept. I should save. Let's eat some food. Still breakfast? Beautiful. I'll take some delicious gruel and coffee. I mean, gruel is just like malto meal or, or something, right? I've always thought gruel was like some sort of porridge type deal where it's just like a, a mushed grain like oatmeal that's just been fucking pulverized to nothing. Ugh, another Temple of Sendar. Look at that. Look at that floozy dancing outside. Wait, is it Stendar that's the... That's the the Randy one, or is that, um... It's not Julianos. Julianos is magic. Who is it? Who is it? I'm gonna look on the wiki real quick. Pantheons. Gods, world information, people, places, service, witch coven, store items, location, services, people, maps... Generic dialogues, factions, successfully avoided an encounter, lovely, temples, Akatosh Arcade de Bella, the goddess of beauty, that's what it is. It's Stendar then. The god of mercy, oh my god, I apologize to that dancer outside. Wow, they have the Crusaders. That's the militant arm of the Temple of Stendar. Hey, let me read this. Let me pop it open while we're traveling. Check this shit out. Akatosh Chantry. It's the Order of the Hour. Uh, and that's the military arm. Order of Arcade is the Knights of the Circle. Order of the Lily is for Debella. The Knight's Mentor. I like that one for Juliano, so that makes sense. Uh, the Kinneran Order for Kinneran. That's boring. Um, Mara is the Marean Knights, also boring. The Crusader for Stendar, cool as hell. But this right here, Knights of Iron, that's what I want to join. God. I would kill. I would kill to be part of it. I would kill to be part of it. Also, what is this? There's a small shrine of Stendar here. I don't care. I'm blowing past this place. Bye. Yeah, order of the... Oh my fucking god, what in the hell is this? What happened? First off, I nearly died. I would like to levitate, please. What happened here? Can someone ELI-5 it for me? Oh my god. That's the first time I've seen a terrain, like, generation thing like this. Because this is, this is obviously not right. <laughs> Come here, horse. Uh-oh. Can I walk here? Get up here. Let me use my sugar lumps. What? Odyssey is too far away, are you kidding me? Shugar lumps? Odyssey is right there. Oh, got her. And I hitched the wagon. But it all glitched out. Look at that, look at that. The levitate is saving me. Alright, I have to wait for this levitate to wear off to try and get this. You believe this shit? I may have to get on the ground and do a wagon rescue. Or something. 
Can I read for an hour? Is that going to clear up my uh, problem? It did. Okay. I'm good. Just keep going this way, and then I'll start up the uh, fast travel again. How bizarre. It's like so flat down there, too. Something happened with that rock. That rock spawning in right there, I, I think. If I had to venture to guess. It almost killed me. Can you imagine if I actually did die? That would have been a, a hilarious death. Oh, I pro my body would have probably skipped across the ground. <laughs> Oh, man. Alright, let's keep going. Let's get to our destination. Let's get to, uh, Saradabu. Saradabu. Sarad. Saradbu. Saradbu. That's actually how you pronounce it, I think. If I had to venture to guess. Oh! Well, fancy that! How close am I to the, uh, the place? Port. That's a journey for tomorrow. Ten hour journey from here. That's not bad. Um, let's see what these inns are. The Black Scorpion. The Thirsty Ogre. Uh, what are you? Your residence? The Queen's Muskrat. Okay. And then who are you on the other side of this building? The Toad and the Huntsman. Well, I'm going to be staying at that Toad, if you know what I mean. May not be Wednesday, my dudes, but uh, we are going to stay here. Oh. Sir? You have a weird, a weird wall problem right there. Uh, may I have the green bananas with garlic? May I have a rum? May I have a rum? 88. So I could get a, a proper 90 just by being drunk now. That's pretty, that's pretty schmexy. The lucky hot shot. Hawk shot. I see relics. I could sell some shit to this place. Got all that jewelry. Let's check their back stock. How many bandages have I gotten? Not bad. Sir, I would like to sell. <laughs> Become in trouble with the law? Maybe it's only if I try to sell it. I wish I could highlight items in my inventory that I don't want to ever show up in here. Blacklist an item from showing up in here. That'd be really nice. What is this? Scholar's Guide to Nymphs? Keeping it. Let's get rid of you. Let's get rid of those straps. I'm in the wagon still, right? Yeah. 
So long as I stay in this menu, I should not get accosted by anybody. Steel Brigadan helmet. Steel Brigadan boots. So, hang on. Is that an a uh, orcish version? Orcish Adamanite. Oh, okay. So then I can get a Daedric version of the same set. Okay. I may do that. I may do that. That may be my alternate set coloration or something like that. Cool. Sell. So, damn. All in gold. Quickly switch to here. Tropics. Okay. I gotta look up the drugs mod to see if I try and sell an item if I get in trouble. I'm also, I'm almost overburdened already because of the, the selling. I love it. Um, I should probably get the wagon before I go, eh? Where did I detach that sucker? I feel like I detached it near the first tavern. I rounded the corner. Went that way. Came into here. What did I do? I went to the hawk shop second. Through here. Where the fuck did I put my wagon? find it. Mark my words, I'll find it. it. May take me a minute to find it, but I'll find it. This way to the hawk shop. Let's check this back alley over here. Ah, hello my dear. Please remove those items. How are they doing by the way? Used and almost new. Need to find another one of friendship, eh? Please remove my 18962 golds. Better. Cool. And now we leave. Check out those other stores. No. No. Is that mage skill? <laughs> it's very imposing. How am I? Oh, I'm doing good. Doing good. Eat. I can sleep on the road. Let's uh let's power let's power our way there. Traveling at night. At night in the rain. Ill advised, but Sometimes it just has to be done. All right. 10 hour journey, ladies and gentlemen. To the port. Let's confirm that is a port before committing. Beautiful. Uh, let's go cautiously. Yeah, it's only a 30 minute difference. Why would I go recklessly from now on? I should just always go cautiously. Who cares if it lasts another hour or so? At least cautiously, too, I have a better chance of avoiding encounters in addition to being able to proc the, um, what is it? If my stam hits rock bottom, with the 5% or 45% or whatever, it'll stop me. <coughs> Maybe that's what happened earlier when I asked why did it stop and didn't say I was hungry or anything. It actually finally triggered correctly because I had it on caution, uh, cautious, move cautiously. Knights of Iron. I'm I'm closing my eyes right now just thinking of joining that chapter. Really nice if I can do it.
scared the hell out of me. Red. Fruit. Fruit, 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 fruit. Yeah, see? Look at that. Now I'm just avoiding encounters left, right, and center. This is nice. Rock to, rock to the left. So dench, dench, Judy Dench. Uh, so dense with vegetation, I can't see anything. And of course, nighttime don't help. Uh oh. Oh, let's take care of it now. I also stifled a, a yawn, so this is probably be a good place to camp. Look at those two. Move to the wagon. Uh, foot. How am I? I am a bit sleepy. Nine. Like to rest for how long? It's ten o'clock at night. Let's do a solid ten again. At least it stopped raining. Daytime. It's like dead silent. It's not right, right? Something's wrong. Like how silent it is. I think there's something wrong with the environmental ambiance mod. At least for jungle day, it's it's deathly silent. Jungle day, clear skies. It's it's, it's oddly and deathly silent. How close are we? Oh, we're pretty much there. What we'll do is we will get to this town. Let's, we're pretty much right there. And we'll uh, we'll stop it, and then we'll travel to um, Belfaria next episode, I think. Sorry to keep everyone waiting. The anticipation is waiting or, uh, right there for uh, wanting to get to that location. But, um, yeah, we'll we'll cut it at that marine or whatever. Meza, meza, ra, 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 ra. And then we'll, uh, we'll go to whatever port I can go to on the south end of the Isle of Belfaria. And I think it's like one giant mountain too, so I'm I'm really curious to see what the, one the topology is going to look like, and two, uh, the the regional like is it a jungle? Is it a is it a conifer forest? Is it just like a a moor type thing, or is it a gradient that goes all the way up into the mountain? I'm I'm very eager to find out. Silence is very off-putting. It's very, very off-putting. You know, I may, I may roll back the environmental ambiance mod. I kind, I really do kind of miss the music. I kind of miss the music, and I'm too lazy to set up the Spotify mod. Uh, I don't have a Spotify account, and I don't really want a Spotify account. Um, and I don't, uh, I don't want to make my own custom one that I have to switch when I go in and out of dungeons and shit. You know, <laughs> I'm lazy. Even though I have a I have a stream deck, I could do it. I could have a playlist. I could do it. Okay, I'll give it. I'll give it a think. I'm gonna keep the mod for now, the environmental ambiance mod. But uh, I may ditch it. We'll see. We'll see how much work it is to get these playlists under control and shit like that, and then we'll go from there. Oh, look at that lighthouse! Nice. Look at that. We made it. All right, everybody. This is where we're going to uh, stop for today. I want to thank you all for watching, and I will catch you all later. Take care.